Today's segment of O oh Brother is sponsored by Daviston Insulation. Visit them on the web at davistoninsulation.com to find out how you can reduce your energy bills by up to 30% and receive a tax credit in the process. Today is a very special day because, of course, it is Christmas Eve, and and also because we have a live performance of the song Brethren that we normally have a recording of for our bumper music. Yeah, welcome to No Brother. I'm Will Lockamy, along with Reed Lockamy. It's the podcast we record at the Brandon Brown and Country Western Delight Studios. Uh, yeah, Reed, you know it's been a very vulture whale Christmas already here at the Brandon Brown and Country Western It really West has. Studios. This is week three of a very vulture whale Christmas, and we have been having three different members of Vulture Whale in each Thursday leading up to Christmas. Now, we're not having Keelan in, and he knows why. Yeah, um, I don't even want to talk about it. Right, right. This it is Keelan disgusting. Yeah, just I just disgusting. call it the situation. That's right. That's like that guy from Jersey Shore. Right. The situation. Except worse. Yeah, even worse than that. <laughs> even worse. All right, but now listen, Will. So Keelan, he's out, and yeah, he knows why. Vulture Whale is yeah. one of our favorite bands, okay. and uh, we were lucky enough to have three of the members in the studio, and that was Wes McDonald playing that song, and that was actually recorded on, uh, before it was Vulture Whale, it was just Wes McDonald at that point. Right, right. Wes? Wes is in the studio. Uh, Yes, Merry Christmas. Look at that. That's right. We have an expert to talk about this. So, Wes, tell us real quickly, Brethren was on what record? It was on 150 in the Furnace. Okay. And this is back when the name of the band was not Vulture Whale, but rather was Wes McDonald, right? Wes McDonald, Wes McDonald and the Fizz. Yeah. Yeah. Some awesome stuff. It's a actually, great record. Yeah, yeah, I got to ruin a couple of their shows and, and play drums um, is that for right? that record. Yeah, I didn't know that. Huh. I filled in while uh, Jay Kurt is pinky. Oh, boy. <laughs> he is he is very uh, fragile, yeah. Jake Waitsman. His yeah. Especially pinkies. in the pinky area. Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, definitely. For sure. All right, so, Will, this is, sure enough, the third and final installment of A Very Vulture Whale Christmas. And what we're going to be doing is playing a special sort of edition of Line, Please. If people have been listening the last two weeks, they know what this is about. We're going to sing two Christmas classics. And Wes is going to be singing along with us, and there are going to be lines where you and I are going to stop singing, Will, and and Wes is going to have to fill those lines in. Easy enough. These are classic songs. Now, Wes, do you feel like you know Christmas songs fairly well? Or? No, not really. You don't listen to Magic 96? No. Hmm. Now, you've got a child, though. Surely you sing some Christmas carols. We have one of those Santa Clauses that sings and dance. Oh, yeah. So it might be a little better this year than previous years. Do you know yeah. Jingle Bell Rock is the only song you know, probably? Uh, I do know that a yeah. little bit. Yeah. Do you, I know the tune of it. Do you yeah. have an Elf on the Shelf? No, we have not gotten there okay. yet. All right. Will's very excited about Listen, Elf on the I'm, Shelf. I'm just obsessed <laughs> at this point. All right, I'm going to go ahead and say that we're going to start this week with, uh, this is a classic, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I'm passing out lyric sheets as we speak, um, and that's pretty much it. And and uh, Wes is just going to fill in the lines where you and I stop singing. Yeah, notice that he uh, is just now getting the lyric sheet. Right. As opposed to Les Newby. Who kind of who who looked over and studied. Studied for yeah. days yes. beforehand. So this so. was a little tougher for Wes. Okay. All right, you ready, Will? <clears throat> sure. You know Dasher and Dancer and Prancer and Vixen. Comet and Cupid and Donder and Vixen. Oh, <laughs> so close. You already said Vixen. <laughs> you already said Vixen. <laughs> Such a short memory span. Yeah. No. Blitzen. That was better Blitzen. than I, than I probably was. That was actually about. pretty good. I knew yeah. it was either Blitzen or Tammy. Now, well, this is weird because we did the Phil or Tammy. That's right. That's a, that's a different <laughs> ranger on the gun. We did the fill-in lines early, so now we actually get to just sing the rest of the Let's song together. Let's just have fun with All right, here we go. But do you recall... The most famous reindeer of all. Dun, dun, dun. Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer. Reindeer had a very shiny nose like a light bulb. And if you ever saw it, saw it, you could even say it glows like a light bulb. And all of the other reindeer, reindeer used to laugh and call him names like Pinocchio. They never let poor Rudolph, Rudolph join in any reindeer games like Monopoly. Then one f- 
foggy Christmas Eve, Santa came to say, ho, 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 Rudolph, with your nose so bright, won't you guide my sleigh tonight? But do, 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 do. Then how the reindeer loved him, loved him, as they shouted out with glee, empty. Turn off the red nose reindeer. Reindeer. You'll, You'll go down in history. Like George Washington. There you go. Awesome. You know what I liked about that? Wes worked Tammy the reindeer in yeah. again near the end of the song. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's pretty good. She's my favorite reindeer. <laughs> she's, a, she's everyone's favorite reindeer. She uh, is the sexiest thing about uh, Christmas, Will. It's just like those reindeer you wanted to have in your yard there. Sexy reindeer. Yeah. The white the sexy reindeer. cut out. She's uh, the only reindeer that wears a thong. That's, <laughs> <true>. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. That's true. It's <laughs> funny put because her in it's the true. Line yeah. All right. Now, Will, this next song is a song that earlier we said we weren't going to do because we thought it was a little bit too difficult. Okay. But sure enough, we're going to do it anyway. Yeah, here's it's a song that we all know, but there's yeah. just the melody on that last line. There's just something. In the middle. You know, Will, I actually figured out what the problem was with the melody. Okay. It was okay. me not knowing how to sing. Well, here's what happened was you were setting yourself up for failure. The song, of course, is I Saw Mommy Kissing Santa Claus. <laughs> and what you were doing was you were saying, I saw mommy kissing Santa Claus underneath the mistletoe last night. Yes, I'm shooting And that's the stars. not what happens in oh. the first verse. Oh. That that last line is I saw mommy kissing Santa Claus underneath the mistletoe last night last night okay I think I can't get it it gets easier from there now right. one of these lines Wes is gonna have to fill in gotcha I've got that underlined yes that's the right. less has it okay. marked or Wes yeah. Wes sorry see that's the problem with having a Wes and a Les yeah. in the same band it's not like I don't know you Wes we know <laughs> All right. that you ready is everybody yep. ready Wes ready here we go I saw mommy kissing Santa Claus underneath the mistletoe last night. She didn't see me creep down the stairs to have a peep. She thought that I was tucked up in my bedroom fast asleep. Then I saw mommy tickle Santa Claus. Underneath his beard so snowy white Oh, what a laugh it would have been If Lord have mercy, baby's got her blue jeans on <laughs> Almost as good Close if Mommy kissing Santa, Santa Claus, Claus last night Now, Daddy had only seen You were close, Wes I, it was, I thought that was it, I thought I had it <laughs> You know what's great about that? He just quoted a song that Brandon Brown and the Country Western Delight were That is true. That was a song of ours. What yeah. was that song again? It was uh, Lord Have Mercy, Baby's, Baby's Got, Got a Blue, a Blue Jeans. We on. actually, Brandon Brown and the Country Western Delight, our Country Western Delight used to cover that song. That's right. Yeah, that's, that's the rhythm. But now, that's Conway Twitty. There you go. I didn't uh, realize What an awkward Conway song Twitty. that is we just sang, though, by the way. Here's the thing. The line, just in, for the record, that Wes uh, came close to but missed on a little <laughs> bit was, uh, oh, what a laugh it would have been. If Daddy had only seen, there are two problems with this line. Number one, it does not rhyme. That's a problem. <laughs> ben and seen rhyme on paper, but they do not actually rhyme. Second part? Forced rhyme. It's a forced rhyme. And here's the second problem. It would not be funny if this man caught his wife making out tickling Santa Claus. Why does this child think that would be funny? That would not be funny. Ask Tiger Woods. This is not a funny situation. <laughs> no. And, uh, you know, as yeah. we'll hear here, Michael Jackson. I did. I really did see mommy kissing Santa Claus. That is the best thing. And as I've said before, <laughs> I've tried to warn Michael I wouldn't do that. Don't do that. Joe has a temper. Do not tell Joe. <laughs> All right.